I got a new cup last week so I wanted to take a moment and share which cup it was and do uh, a short unboxing. So this is only going to be an unboxing, not really a walkthrough um, of the features and details about this cup really. Just kind of a quick uh, initial look at it and what I think about it. So if you're curious, stay tuned. Hello everyone, it's Red Herring. I hope you're having a great day. Uh, it is a few days after Christmas, so I hope you all had a safe and happy holiday season. We're coming up on New Year's and I wish you all the best for 2017. So as I was saying, I did receive a new cup or a new cup to the market and that cup is called the Casco Cup. And when you search for it under the FDA registration, they are a manufacturer. So uh, they do manufacture menstrual cups as well as some other things. I believe uh, you can check them out, but um, they do also make the green cup of Maine. And I did introduce that cup or I did an unboxing of that cup a while back. Um, and actually this cup is exactly the same uh, there I don't think there's anything different from it but we will uh, take a look at it in a second first of all any links websites or discounts that I might have at this time are going to be in the description below if you find anything interesting or helpful in this video please give it a thumbs up share and don't forget to subscribe I'm going to do a walk around of this box or turn around of this box and you can pause it if you need to uh, I did get the size one because on the um, the uh, green cup of Maine, I got the size two. So you'll see here that they are a molding company. I can't really see what it says right now and I don't have my big screen on. Um, so there is their website and I will leave it in the description. Also, if you miss it and there's nothing on the bottom, but here is the very top of it. I didn't open this box yet. You can still uh, see that it's still sealed. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it open now. And here is the inside of the box. Here is the pamphlet that uh, the cup comes with. It's pretty basic. The typical things that uh, each of these pamphlets normally say when you purchase one of these menstrual cups. I'm going to go ahead and flash up the um, general size guidelines. It has all of the measurements that they claim um, on these two size menstrual cups. You can go ahead and pause this if you need to. Also here is a little bit about their case since it isn't a cloth uh, pouch that you normally get and you can go ahead and pause this if you need to. Then the case and the cup are in this plastic bag. Here is the case that each cup comes with. You, now you cannot purchase this cup on its own. It only comes with the case and you can purchase the case on its own. Um, the cups only come in the clear color or clear frosted white and they offer it in two different sizes, a small and a large. And I have both of them, but um, under different names. Here's the bottom of the case. These dots are holes uh, for good airflow. The front side of the case does feel like a silicone. It uh, is soft and squishy, but it does have some firmness to it. So it doesn't really like just cave in uh, like a soft silicone does. And then the back of this case has uh, a harder plastic. So, you can hear it there. The case has a little tab right here uh, so that you can lift it easily. Uh, you can kind of hear it snap shut. It has a little lip on the inside so that the um, silica or the cover of it sits well on top of the uh, hard plastic and they won't come apart. I'm gonna go ahead and open it and oh, there's the menstrual cup. Um, I hope you can see that it's kind of just like white against white on this. I was just looking at the cover of the um, case and I'm going to pop this inside out so that you could see it a little bit better. But there is something molded on the inside 
and it says made in USA and that this is a healthcare green. So here is the Casco cup and like I said, it's exactly the same as the green cup of Maine. They have the same markings and everything. So uh, this does say made in Maine right under here under my finger. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that very well. Let me get close up and personal here so I can see on this little screen. So uh, it also has uh, measurement markings on the inside. Yep, they're on the inside, a half an ounce, a quarter of an ounce. On the opposite of uh, the ounces, it does have it in milliliters. So let me go ahead and swap this around so that you could see it. And um, there is a number one on this cup to indicate that is it is a size one or a size small, and it's right there. Um, there are four um, equal distant holes right underneath the rim. It's, it's a little bit down from the rim. It's not too far down and you can see that right there. They're uh, kind of larger holes um, so that would probably help get it to open a little bit better. Um, the stem is a nice short solid piece but it is flimsy all the way around it has three grip rings you can hear them there and they do have a, a secondary rim and it's very slight and it has a nice transition so there's not like a hard edge or anything if you're sensitive to those kinds of things you shouldn't have any problems with that now this cup is really really close to um, the Diva Cup, but it is uh, quite a bit softer. So if you like the shape and the size of the Diva Cup, then one of these cups might be great for you, the Casco Cup or the Green Cup of Maine, uh, but these are a little bit softer. If you're having maybe cramping issues with the Diva Cup, this would be a great option. Here is my green cup of mane. It's the larger of the two sizes that they offer. And here is my Casco cup, uh, which is a size one. And they are the same length. The only thing that's different between these two cups are the diameter. So uh, the small has a bit, uh, it is a bit more narrow. And that is the same with the Diva cup between its size one and size two is just that diameter. And I hope that you can see this. I know my light is kind of bright right into it. Um, and so between the, the large uh, green cup of Maine or Casco cup and the Diva cup, uh, the Casco cup or green cup of Maine is just a little bit smaller in diameter from the Diva Cup. So um, here's the Green Cup of Maine and here's the Diva Cup. Well, that's all I have about uh, the Casco Cup or the Green Cup of Maine. I know that I, this was for the Casco Cup, but since they are the same company, I did want to bring in the Green Cup of Maine uh, because they are the same cup, essentially. Um, so it's like I have both of the sizes with me. Um, and if I missed anything or if you had additional questions, go ahead and leave me a comment down below and let me know if you're using the Diva Cup, if it's been, um, or if you used it, if it was a little bit too firm for you and you wish that there was something that was just a little bit softer, uh, maybe this is the cup you're looking for. Until I see you next year, take care.